Welcome to the new features demonstration for Cabinet Vision Solid 2011 R2. In this video we will be talking about the new features that have been added to the assembly level of Cabinet Vision. In previous versions of Cabinet Vision, when you would change the material of a part in the assembly view of an object, the panel stock tab would be displayed. Let's go ahead and check this using Cabinet Vision Solid 2011 R1. As you can see, our panel stock tab is now currently being shown. Let's try the same thing in Cabinet Vision Solid 2011 R2. And here you can see that the recent tab is now displayed. In previous versions of Cabinet Vision Solid, when you exploded a 3D view, edge banding would stand off of the parts they were attached to. Starting with Cabinet Vision Solid 2011 R2, you can specify whether to have edge banding explode or stick to the parts they are assigned to. Let's see how this works. Let's begin by moving the explode slider over to explode the assembly out. You can see here after exploding the object that the edge banding has separated from the ends, drawer stretcher, and deck. To change this, I just right click in any part of the view and select properties to display the view properties dialog. Now that the view properties dialog is showing, you can see the new option explode banding from part. Unchecking this option will cause the banding that was previously exploded to stick to the parts. Watch what happens to the view once I uncheck this option and click OK. As you can see, our edge banding has snapped right back to our parts. This concludes our demonstration of the new assembly features in Cabinet Vision Solid 2011 R2. Thank you for viewing this video and please take a look at our other videos on the new features in Cabinet Vision.